is being poor a mindset circumstance or is it just passed down genetically Okay. It could be part of a, a circumstance. Let's say that a circumstance start off first. Okay. The parents are poor and don't have the means to even support the, the family, but we're bringing kids in, you know, we're bringing kids in. Now I'm two kids in and I'm barely able to keep my lights on. We barely have food in the pantry in the refrigerator so it can be part of the circumstances that you were brought into now when you get to that that mindset as you grow up i will say this a lot of people older people who i've talking to the elders a lot of them you know i'm talking about 70 years old 80 years old they would say this to me mitch i didn't even know we were poor because we all played together when it was sunday we did have at least a clean dress a clean pair of pants blue jeans to go to church okay. this is back in the day okay. because people did do that back in the day you know okay so so if you're saying that that's what you hear from the older generation yes. what why would they even say something like that when they got older because as you get older and let's say you're in school and you can see the difference because you're comparing is that you what you're saying see, you're comparing well, you, you can say compare yeah you it's compare you, you would have to compare yes if you so, so so basically what you're saying is all right so what i have now right compared to what i had when i was younger i have more so i'm comparing to back in the day so what What's the first thing you think? First thing you think is I was poor back then because I have so much now. Well, yes, that's you what can you say do. that. But, that but, but let's say just evolution, you know, because I remember when I was married at the time and um, my my wife at the time was like, OK, um, my son has his own room. Oh, we need to go and put a VCR DVD player in his room and a, a flat screen in his room it's like man i didn't have that back in the day he'll need that stuff no he don't he doesn't need that right now we need to get him a little computer device for what no he's so young he don't need that right now no i didn't have that when i was growing up i know how but, hard but, but, times was no he don't need that right now okay so this is how i feel about the question now and congregation please chime in to this let us know i want i want to hear your opinion about this too because mitch thinks that it's a circumstance that people go through and then when they get old they find out that uh they you know may have uh, been poor so then it becomes a mindset my thing is it's a mindset period i think i think being poor depending on how you utilize your money a lot of people don't know how to utilize the money that they have so they can make themselves poor uh looking uh living check to check don't know where the next meal is coming from some people can actually do this some people bring up upon themselves a bunch of kids having these babies all of this when you know you can't even take care of yourself come on let alone let alone a, another child now, guarantee, maybe in the com in the, uh, in the comments, people are gonna be like, "Well, you, some people lose their jobs, some people this, blah 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 blah." That is a circumstance, but you can overcome that and have the mindset of taking care of business the right way when it comes around. If you know you're in a bad situation, then hey, look, I need to uh, start working on, you know, changing my situation. Versus, uh, uh, I'm just in, I'm just in the rut right now because you'll stay in that rut, you know. Yes. And, and so so my thing is if you're making 40k a year if you're making 100k a year you still can be poor true people don't yeah Fact. you can still be 
poor, no matter what you're making. So it's a mindset in how you're utilizing your actual money. A lot of people think they, they need all these other things or they compare themselves to other people that have different things. Why do you compare yourself to them? Why do you, why, and you know the little quote, you're trying to keep up with the Joneses. Right, right, right. Trying right. to get everything that they have. But why do we do that? Why do you want to be like somebody else? Why don't you be yourself and be an individual and take care of what's right in front of you? Kane, and that was, that was, I agree with what you were saying, but that still doesn't negate the fact that I have my wife and now we two kids in, she's mm -hmm. working, I'm working, it's mm -hmm. a loving family, and it's still hard to do the things that we want to do as far as our family unit, we're, we're trying to manage the money correctly. And when you don't know, you might, okay. I had to you go research. And when you don't yeah, know, you need to research, but we haven't yeah. researched. We, I had to, we wanted to get some don't furniture. Know, we, we wanted to get some furniture. We went to that rental center and we rented this bedroom yeah. set and unbeknownst we done paid so much money for that bedroom set yeah. that we rented or whatever the job my job is my, look but hold up my education i didn't uh go to college that ain't got nothing to do with college. i know i'm just I'm, I'm laying out the facts for the for for everybody for and the common yeah. man and but we're trying to 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 do it to do it together to stay sustained within this family unit and to go forth and let our kids grow up to have more than we had. How far are you willing to go? And how far do you, you want to go in? You, do you take another job or are you saying go to school? Do you qualify for public assistance? Because you don't believe in that. Is that a correct statement from you? Believe in what? Public assistance. Public assistance. Yeah. For 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 a, a, a two parent household, no. But we're still no. not meeting the if we qualify yes, for you can. if we qualify. I'm, hold up, because Dude, we won't. We make, won't. The, you got two two a two able body adults working. How can you still be down? Let us know in the con in, in the comments. I know y'all gonna try to rip me up. No, this this is good. If you know how to if you know how to manage your money, you don't need all this other stuff that you see other people with. You don't need that big old flat screen. You don't need that rental center furniture. You don't Come need on. that. I wanted you to say this. And then can you speak to this for point right here? People, you can't be afraid to talk to someone to help you, to educate you into financial planning. Now, when I say talk to someone in, about financial planning, Cain, do you think it's a a racial um, barrier? And I'm saying this in the aspect of black people wouldn't want to seek financial counseling. White people would or wouldn't seek financial counseling. Is that does that hold any basis right there, or just people I, I in don't. general? I think I think I don't think it's a race thing when it comes to that. I think just people may be ignorant in the in the in the sense where they just don't know. And they don't know what they don't know, but however they're not trying to figure it out either. Okay. They just kind of just going by. They just say hey, it's working. What I'm doing now is working. Or they they're too, you know, they they're so far in the game that I can't risk it. I don't know. I don't know, man. I I just got to stick with what I know right here. And some people like that, but that still don't make them poor. That just make them, they are more conservative with their money. I get it. Well, don't be living outside your means if that's what you're going to be doing. And Kane, what could, what do you consider poor? So it's a mindset. So there's not a specific number. That's why I say it's a mindset, not a circumstance. So it's a mindset. You only poor because you, you, you say yourself uh, that you're, you're only poor if you compare yourself to someone else. 
If you're comparing yourself to someone else, then you, you're gauging, like, oh, I have this much, or they have that. They have that type of car. They have that type of house. Yeah. So I'm, I must be poor. Yeah. I'm not making that much money. Or I didn't get the opportunity to go to college. Or blah, 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 blah. Right? They, it, all these uh, excuses and all these other stuff. So now I'm poor or whatever. No, man. This it's, it's is strictly a mindset. It took me a long time to get to that point where I can distinguish it's all about how you manage what you have. That's true. And if you don't have a lot at this particular moment, you gain tools. Mm. To, to you, you gain these yeah. tools. And, and when I say tools, you don't, you don't necessarily have like a four-year college, but you gain tools to better yourself and your circumstance. That, i.e., um, you, you may do a trade or something like that. You know, something to better yourself. And then you start researching on other things to have your money make money for you if that's what you're looking for. But if you're content with where you at, because there are a lot of people that are content in where they at. Is there something wrong with that? No, nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that. But you can't you can't point them out and be like, man, they, they live in poor over there. They're OK with that. They, they don't want to take that risk. They don't want to do that research they don't want to do anything for that and if they did they would reach out to people that have done it you know yeah. they were like okay well if i'm in this situation i want to get out of this situation who do i need to talk to somebody that's not in this situation hey, yes yes and then you reach out to them and, and just kind of you know but sometimes pride gets in the way mm. sometimes they be like I'm, I'm just too prideful or i'm embarrassed in my situation right now i am uh, over my head in credit card debt, whatever, right? So now I know I don't. I'm, I'm living check to check. I'm. Uh, I got all this debt, these loans, whatever, right? And they're embarrassed about it. And sometimes that's what keeps them away from progressing and thinking they can figure it out. We're not even reaching out to people that have been through it or know a way to help them get through it. You see what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah, Kane. You know when you said being in debt and things like that i you know mm -hmm. when you buy these airplane tickets now i was very surprised that now you can even buy your airplane ticket and put it on payments you know do you think yeah. that's a good thing yeah. man no i, I, I no. was very I, I, surprised I don't, I don't, I don't, to see that i don't I, man they do it with cell phones people they will finance their cell phone their iphone the the uh, galaxy whatever right whatever they have they will finance that thing it's a thousand some dollars they will finance it and put it in their payments for the next two years and probably not even using the phone anymore. plus uh the payment of finance the phone mm -hmm. that's a bill then you paying for the phone service itself yep. another bill yep. that is crazy to me yeah yeah i just think when it's you don't trap. need these things yeah. yeah no it's 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 only yeah they making it easy for you to have the latest and the greatest but do you need the latest and the greatest if your if your job doesn't require that particular type of phone then you don't need it you don't need it just get you something that you know so you can be content but kane i just want to do something for myself I, I get it but you don't want to finance it do something for yourself and get some education Ooh. on your finances. Ooh. Okay. Nobody want to do that, though. Nobody want to do that. They just want some materialistic type stuff. And that's basically what we're talking about, just material. Because it's not a need for an iPhone 14. It's not a need for it. Unless your business is taking pictures with it. Hmm. You see what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or I'm recording uh uh um uh, podcast or whatever right and i'm investing my money into this because I, i'm trying to see if i can get some good return from this investment but if you just you just want to just <laughs> just to show everybody else you got one come on who cares who cares and so that 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 would be my thing i think it's all a mindset Guaranteed, there are the anomalies where the circumstances happen right. and this, that, and third or whatever. But if you can deal with what you have, a lot of people just don't can't deal with what they have. And that's why they go into this crazy debt. By all means, I've been there too. I've been there. But I, I, I 
did my research to get out of it. You guys can do the same exact thing. Right. You can. You can. It's possible. And guess where it's at? It's all on the internet. It's everywhere, and that and that's practically free, especially if you can get some Wi-Fi somewhere. Because Wi-Fi, is you know, you ain't even gotta have, you know, you can have your phone connect to Wi-Fi and you can do some research. <laughs> so you ain't gotta drive you know? twenty miles, thirty miles. <laughs> you say I can just do that in the comfort of the house. Yeah, man. Okay. Come on, come on. Do your research. Do your research. I think, uh, like I said, just being poor uh, to me would be a mindset. And you guys can correct me. I could be wrong. I can be wrong. You guys can probably put in the comments uh, um, a circumstance that that proves me wrong. I, I, but let's not let's not make that the rule. Just make it an exception. I, I think I would go with both. Uh, both? Yeah, yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. I would go with both, but uh, that last one genetically passed down. Nah, no, nah. nah, we could t- we <laughs> ten that one. No, no, sir. Oh, sir. <laughs> Congregation, let us know. Let us know how you feel about this. Does it hit home for you? Mm-hmm. And you're like, man, you know what? I do need to do something and quit comparing myself to next door. Because mm-hmm. nobody, you, all that materialistic stuff doesn't go nowhere with you when you pass on. True. You know what I mean? And all that little crazy materialistic stuff, you don't even want to get that to the uh, y- your uh, your family. Like, man, what, what? why do you need <laughs> all of that stuff? You know, give it to your family, but they're gonna fight over it after you're gone. I, uh, I, uh, I'm on. I know uh, people in the congregation know about that. Of course, yes. of course. Money, is, what they say, money is the root of all. Yes. People. And when you, and when you get money and you didn't earn it, oh my God, people will fight. Over yes. It. They will fight over it, man. I'm I'm supposed to get that. I'm the youngest child. I'm this. I'm mm-hmm. that. I'm supposed to have that. Set your affairs together beforehand. Even you know, put together a trust. Look that up and see what it all entails and start getting your, you know, creating that generational wealth. It can be smaller. Just like you said, you want the um, your your uh, kids to have more than what you what you had. Yeah. So we just started, even though. People will say that we we got a uh, we came late to the party because of. Slavery, whatever circumstance, right? yes, circumstances, <laughs> yeah. right? But however, it's been here and we can take care of what we have right in front of us because it's a mindset. It's a mindset. So don't the circumstances that happened 100, 200, 300 years ago doesn't affect you right now. You are in your way for success. That's all I got to say. What you got to say for them? Well, I just want to go on what you just said. Open up your eyes. Open up yeah. your eyes and your mind because yeah. the media and so many people, mm-hmm. especially in black culture, will push the 300, 400 years of slavery when open up your minds, open up your yeah. mind, open up your eyes because you can be the one preventing yourself from moving up that's all think about that. definitely definitely hey look that's the uncomfortable truth <laughs> hey let's go do something baby <laughs>you know if you don't want to see us but you want to just listen to us we on apple podcast spotify amazon pandora iHeartRadio, radio google Podcast, all of them all of them 